Disney Mania. This is a new documentary that hit HBO Max uh, over C Christmas weekend. I was very busy, didn't have time to watch it. But uh, I'll give you guys a little secret. As you guys can see from my background, I'm a collector. One of the first things that got me into collecting was, besides collecting movies, I, that's one of the first things I started collecting, was Beanie Babies. I had a ton of Beanie Babies. Well, I shouldn't say a ton. I didn't have as much as some people did. Basically, what had happened was, is if you don't know, Beanie Babies were in the 90s were this big thing. They were worth tons of money, right? Me, being born in, in like, 2003, I was about like probably six and eight i was in a goodwill bookstore and this was a bookstore that was a goodwill store but it was only for books right go in there and i find this handbook and this handbook was uh for beanie babies and how they were worth a lot of money me not knowing at the time that they were worth actually nothing because beforehand they were actually worth a lot of money, but not anymore. So I was finding all these Beanie Babies in the thrift shops that one to two dollars and being like, oh, this one's worth a lot of money. And they were actually worth nothing. And that's kind of why I stopped because, you know, Beanie Babies were absolutely fat. If you, the reality is, you know, people compare like stuff to like Funko Pops to stuff like that. But the, the way I see it, they're very different because... When I was collecting those stuffed bears, it was just a stuffed bear, you know? It wasn't like, oh, this is something I like, like Star Wars, Star Trek, Halloween, um, all those di Rick and Morty, different things like that, right? Not based on all these different franchises I love, right? So it was very different. But I enjoyed collecting them for the time. But then when I realized they weren't worth anything, I kind of just got rid of them because it was like, there, I, there was too much of an abundance of them. I liked them. But this is, that's why I was interested in this documentary. It kind of brought back that feeling. And I think that's the best way to s describe this documentary. If you were ever a collector um, of Beanie Babies, this is a documentary made for you to kind of make you remember the time that you collected. And kind of, and for those who don't know, kind of educate what kind of fad this was. Because if you weren't alive when this happened, this documentary does a great job giving insight to it because people were absolutely insane about these things for years it was absolutely insane that's what this documentary really highlights and i enjoyed watching it for that reason because it kind of highlighted how insane people were getting over a damn stuffed bear toy um that you know accidentally became this major phenomenon for like a decade and I think that was really interesting and I really enjoyed that from a collector's perspective watching this documentary and I think that's the best way to describe it if you've ever collected things you'll get something out of this documentary you'll relate to it it's not a 10 out of 10 documentary or anything but it's an interesting one-time watch and I definitely recommend it for that reason if you were a collector if you've ever liked collecting things if you collected Beanie Babies yourself definitely worth the watch highly recommend and that's my thoughts on Beanie Mania.